Hey guys, so I want to talk about the Harvester. This is a, uh, a new program, a uh, script, Python script, just came out not too long ago. Um, if you read a lot of the security blogs, you have probably seen this. Uh, so I just want to go over it real quick. Uh, the tool is natively included on Backbox, so if you have it, uh, if you have Backbox, you already have this program. So <clears throat> uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the usage. There you go. Not a whole lot of options. Um, you can definitely play around with it, um, but we can run a quick uh, query. And what this will do will um, search for uh, objects in a particular domain. So uh, just for kicks, uh, I'm just going to do gmail.com. Obviously, if I was looking for some email addresses, uh, we can query gmail.com domain. Um, and uh, you can set the length if you want, but we want to do the data source. Um, as you see up here, you can type in any one of these or all if you want to do a quote unquote whole harvest. I thought it was kind of funny to add that in there. Um, but you can just uh, type in Google, and I would hope that Google would know a couple things about Gmail uh, and stuff on it. So we can search uh, for strings regarding gmail.com. Uh, on Google and uh, Harvester will go out and run Google searches query and parse that data uh, as you can see we got a bunch of email addresses <coughs> there's a couple SMTP servers, IMAP servers um, so it's good for information gathering uh, as you can see there's quite a few email addresses you can limit this output with the dash L uh, command if you want to you can also do a number of other switches as well um, quick tutorial, it's a very cool tool. I would definitely uh, suggest you go download it, start playing around with it. Uh, it's very cool, check it out.